funny how African American people can sit up here and talk about things that's going on with the economy, but it's, it's seeing how they doing it at home. They need to get up off their ass and do it. Stop talking about it, be about it. It takes months to start something. It takes you to lead and to have people to follow. So once again, stop talking about the economy, how bad it is. Stop talking about the situation and do something about it. Get off your bus. Stop talking about it. Just do something about it. January 2nd, 2010, I was asked to give a message to the world, the first thing that came to my mind was love, lots and lots of love, more love. Like they say, love heals everything. Love is like this ultimate power. So that's my message to the world, more love. And if you're black, keep it tight. That's all I got to say. My name is Anthony. My message is believe in Jesus. The time is at hand. That's my message to the world. Okay. Hi, my name is Charlene. I'm from Los Angeles, California, and my message to the world is uh, hoping that 2010 will be a better year where we can move toward a peaceful world, a, a green society, and a world uh, full of love. Hey, I'm Eric Nunez from California, Oakland. Uh, I just want to give a message to the world, actually from my friend. Just give it, share it out to all of you. Telling about everybody, keep going to school. All the, everybody, just keep going to school because that's the only way you're gonna get up in life. Um, because in life and school, they're both different. Life teaches, gives you a test that teaches you a lesson, and school gives you a lesson and then gives you a test on it. 2010 world, it's getting smaller. Let's start taking care of each other. And let's be sensible. I love you all. Bye. Uh, hello, world. You know, I'm not too good in talking, but I just want to tell the world, I said thank you, thank God for enabling everyone who's not able and who's able to have a new year and a happy new year. And I just thank God, I just want people to just come together and to love each other and, and just take care of the children because it's serious in the world and uh, I love people and all I want to do this year is to be more prosperous and to help the people more and I just want to thank the world you know and I want to thank God for being in Oakland, California and to be around these gentlemen here and I just want to say thank, thank you Jesus I, you know, and everybody all over the world have a happy, happy New Year. All right, so you know, the whole theme of 2010 for everybody, I just mean, should be DGS. You know, DGS stands for one thing and one thing only. That's don't give a fuck. Because, you know, this year we've been through a lot of bullshit. We finally got Bush out the office and we got Obama. We got a black man for once in our lives. I know y'all white people mad. <laughs> I'm half, I feel for y'all, but I was raised by my mama, she black, so fuck y'all at the same time. But it's really, don't give a fuck, cause you know, you're getting rid of all that bullshit, so 2010, it's about to be a new, a new fucking era, you know? So really, eliminate that bullshit, you know, three simple rules. First off, protect yourself, look out for yourself first off and first most. Then it's, fuck them. If they ain't good for you, fuck them, DGF. That's the third and final rule. That's what supports everything. That supports your whole lifestyle. I don't give a fuck. It's for me. Be selfish. Do you. Because in the long run, regardless if you're a twin and you came out the same coochie the same time as the other nigga, you one minute different than him. And you gonna end one different than anybody else. So look out for yourself and do you. Because other motherfuckers are gonna hate and other people are gonna envy you. Other people are gonna be happy for you. People that's happy for you, you know, bring them a little closer. People who hate you for it, fuck them. DGF, don't give a fuck about me. And that's really the whole thing for 2010. Do you be happy, get out this fucking recession, get off your lazy ass. If you don't smoke weed, at least do it productive. You know what I'm saying? You know, get your ass up and go get a swisher. You know, don't stay at your damn house and roll a fucking bowl. You know, bowls is for the lazy motherfuckers. Get your ass up and get a swisher. Learn how to fucking roll. Be productive with the motherfucker. And you know what, just don't sit there, jack off, read a fucking book. You gonna kill your brain cells, might as well rebuild them, make them stronger. Don't do nothing stupid. DGF. 
Okay. Um, what I want to say is just 2010, just to be positive. Um, there's a lot of haters out there always trying to hate. Just like what he said, just do you. Um, focus on the positive. Like, leave the negative behind. And it'll be all right. For me, for 2010, I mean, I'll put it this way. In 09, I learned a whole heap from a lot, from a whole lot of people. And one of the main things that I learned is that it is very, very important to just love yourself. Everything that you want to do, everything that, you know, whatever goals you set, all that stuff, you know, it starts with you and you can't wait on nothing. For me, for like my old coach used to say, for my money, um, for this year, my thing is to just live more, live free, love more, cry less, fear none, and just enjoy life to the fullest. So, for 2010, love you, love others, do you, increase the peace, all that good stuff. Just enjoy. Life is short. It's hard, it's short, so make the best of it. And just ride that bad boy till the wheels fall off.